in front there. <laughs> Boom. And you're all left suffering. We're all left suffering. Yes, it's a collective. We're a team. We're all a unit. Speaking of units. You're a unit. Give us a flex. Oh, what would be your go-to like bodybuilding? If you were to like, show off your most muscular, what do you think is your best angle pose to make you look jacked? Um, I would pull my pants down and squeeze my testicles really hard so you could see all the veins in my ball back. Mm-hmm. What happens to the rest of your body when you do that? Well, I have a giant erection, so every time I get one, my rest of my body shrivels up because the blood's got to come from somewhere. Impressive. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, no, my flex would probably... I gave an opportunity there to like... <laughs> I was going to compliment him, actually leading what? to give you a compliment, but no, he had to turn it into a dick joke. What What do you think my flex would be? You have quite broad shoulders. For a dude that's not a particularly uh, muscle-focused person, you don't build muscle no. in a gym. No. You do more cardio for football. Yes. You have quite broad shoulders. So I would think you'd do something that accentuates your shoulders. So like this one? The... <laughs> yep. Or just the one they lean over like that and... Oh, boy. Or I'll oh, just be like... My phone keeps going off. This would be it, Nate. There it is. It'd be this. Just yeah, shame me. my shoulder. No, shame my titties. There you go. What's your favourite one? Uh, I'm working on a move right now that oh. I saw the golden... It, actually, posing is so fucking hard. Posing is so hard. It's it's like a one arm up flex, the other one comes around, so you're showing shoulder, and then it's a... Do you know what a vacuum is? Yes, I used it to clean my ass. <laughs> you knew that was coming. Come on, man. I, I do did. not know what a vacuum is. I'm a bit disappointed that I set you up for it, to be honest. <laughs> a vacuum that sucked. is where they you like suck your with your transverse abdominals the in because you've got two layers of abs outside I do not <laughs> everyone does just whether they actually work you've got outer layer which is like the ones you see and then you've got your transverse the ones underneath that actually your core yeah. so you suck them like oh oh yeah so it's like you use your abs to pull it all in but by doing that it also then accentuates lats and like tightens your waist oh. and makes you look Anyway, point is, working on trying to get that, but it's really hard to breathe while you're doing it, and I'm not very good at posing. So that's a thing I'm working on right now for my fitness stuff that I do. Well, I'm going to come up with my own signature pose for you people. Oh, I cannot wait to see that. Next video, Johnny's going to have a sweet pose that we're going to intro with. It's going to be the ball bag one. It won't be the ball bag one. We're not getting (laughs) cancelled. Today, we're checking out Hollow Front. We're all left suffering. Yeah, been a while since we've heard from... Oh, it hasn't actually been that long since we heard from Hollow Front. They did the song with Dakota. Is this the other song? No, this is the first single they've released Ooh. without Dakota on their tracks. So this okay. is like a new era of Hollow Front. What are you expecting? Do you? Is there another member? Have they got a new person in the band? I have not checked that out. Are you expecting Just someone else to take up clean vocals? Or... What's say here? Happy release date. Nothing there. Oh, first other comment. Man, those cleans are amazing. Okay, so that has... Tyler has stepped up on clean vocals. All right. Great. Well, let's just jump in and we can find out. Yeah. You guys are going to like and subscribe and do all that sort of stuff. Uh, If you're still here after the ball bag stuff, then thank you very much. Just means you're a regular subscriber to our channel because... (laughs) (laughs) Nick Nocturnal's not talking about his ball bag, is he? I don't know if any other reactors talk about it. Uh, <laughs> Orion, buddy, talk about your balls for me. Three, two, one. That's a cool riff. Yep. Oh, I like that. I have a gripe. What are they going to do live when they've only got one guitarist and they've written it with two? Nothing. No? Like that. Okay. It's a visual thing and it's a me being a... Video guy. Yeah. It's very clearly shot on a green screen. Okay. You can see how crisp their outlines are oh. against the background. It's a very clear... Oh. For me, that bothers me. 
because I've I seen their videos be fantastic before. Yeah, I wonder if I'll notice now looking at it. Okay. Yeah, have a look. Is that like just like a, a post production VFX style thing? They haven't like blended them or something or I is don't it the footage that they've decided to use behind? No, probably the way it's lit is that Okay. Anyway. Just instantly bothers me. But oh. the song so far is phenomenal. Yeah. Oh, uh, wait, no, that bit, yeah. That's a good voice. That sounds great. Yeah. Well, I can't stop it now. Uh, yeah, it's only a, a couple of scenes for me where I can notice it. Cool. Uh, and when they put like the effects over, I think it kind of masks it a little it bit. It does. Yeah. yeah, it's not done poorly. It's just, as I said, for what I've seen them do in their films before, it stood out to me straight away. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. But uh, it's not something that's like glaringly obvious and taking away from the experience for me. It just, I have no. Nah, it's just a thing you notice because yeah. you look at that shit yeah. quite a lot. Uh, you know what else I'm noticing about this song? It's lost a little of the Polaris vibe. Oh, I'm so glad you said that because I was thinking at the start being like, I wonder how it's going to go. Yeah. And it hasn't got that as as much as yeah. previously. Which I like. And I think that's got partly to do with his vocals and the way that they're writing now to utilise yeah. his voice. That was a tough call. It's a fucking pit call if ever I've heard one. The tail turn is sick. Okay, I'm so glad I paused on this guy because that's what before I was like, oh, I'm getting a bit of an era vibe. Then I realized it's not about the music. He's wearing a turtleneck that's black and he's looking like yeah. a smooth criminal. Yeah. That's what I was getting. Smooth criminal. Layers. Mm. Oh, get your chunk on. Cool, 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 cool. Really liked it. I thought it was good. Yeah, I enjoyed that. That's really cool to see if that's a, a hint of where they're going. I'm down. I'll go along for the ride. Yeah, for sure. And look, I think that losing um, someone like Dakota with a voice like his, it's always going to be interesting to see where a band goes from there because two things. Number one, you can't completely cut those huge melodic moments out in music moving forward mm -hmm. because it's one of the things that, you know, makes them so special. Second of all, 
As much as he has a nice voice, it's still quite different to Dakota. I wonder how the older songs are going to translate. I also wonder how he's going to hold up being the sole vocalist in a full set of Sing, Scream, Sing, Scream. I was Scream. that during that song alone. I was like, oh, that's, he's really just like backing up straight away. Yeah. Yeah, that's interesting. It's going to be a lot of hard work, for sure. I mean, they've got some real heavy stuff and they've got some really pretty moments. So that's, that's going to be interesting for sure. Uh, who knows, maybe they'll end up getting a second guitarist that has uh, vocal capabilities as well. Yeah, it's, it's always interesting whether you get someone back in a band and loses someone, would they replace them or they go, we're just going to play as us for now. It's a it's an interesting move, that one. It'd be a hard one for them because the guitar work is so intricate and it's, it, it is so metalcore at, at times where both guitars have got their own identity doing their own thing. Mm. So it'd be interesting. Uh, I'd love to see them live. I really do quite like this band's tunes. So do I. That that album with the gold on it, mm-hmm. I don't ever remember what that's called. Why don't I remember what that's called, Johnny? I don't know, man. I don't remember anything. You're asking the wrong person. Yeah. Well, I'm excited for the upcoming album, The Fear of Letting Go, out October 27th. What did you guys think of We're All Left Suffering? What do you guys think of Johnny's pose that he's going to do for you in the next video? Don't do it. Okay. Save it. All right. Build up to it. Okay. Body like, build up. Hey, it. there we go. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out. Sorry about the ball bag stuff at the start. Sorry to end on that. Sorry about him. Have a great night.